The mission of the Providenciales Chamber of Commerce is to ensure a strong, viable economic climate in Providenciales in particular and the Turks and Caicos Islands in general, and to be the principal advocate for business before the Turks and Caicos government. We want to be the leading organization dedicated to creating a climate where business can prosper. On Monday, September 7, 2009, at the Sands Resort, the Provo Chamber of Commerce held its annual general meeting and held their 2009 elections where a new president and executive emerged. Local businessman and social commentator Albrey Butterfield Jr. was appointed as the new president, replacing Ms. Tina Fenimore, and his vice president is Tanya Parnell, who takes over the post formerly held by Alan Hutchinson. President Albrey Butterfield, in his acceptance speech, stated, quote, I will work very hard and to the best of my ability. I want to say thank you and look forward to working with all of you to get this chamber running to order." End quote. Vice President Tanya Parnell stated in her acceptance speech, quote, If Mr. Butterfield brings change, I bring continuity. I hope we can bring change to the business community. End quote. At the annual general meeting, it was made public that the membership number has decreased to 36 paid members. News 4 asked past President Titus DeBoer why he thinks the numbers have dropped. Another reason I think is quite simply economics. Um, anyone who's in business in Providence Charlie's will know that the past year, I'd say even year or two years, have been very challenging. So people are looking at their membership fees, which if I remember correctly, are somewhere in the anywhere from 85 to 400 and something dollars to join the Chamber of Commerce, depending on the number of people you employ. You know, these days, people are going to say, more so than in previous years, what am I getting out of my membership? You know, am I getting benefits in the promotion of my business? How my business is being featured? Am I getting discounts out of it? Um, how effective is the advocacy uh, on my business behalf? Uh, you know, those are all questions that need us to say will be asked. Outgoing President Tina Fenimore gave a short but motivating speech and said, quote, We have all been through trying times over recent years with financial, political and natural catastrophes that have visited our shores. Being a resilient group of business people, we have towed the line and steered the ship towards the right direction, end quote. The new positions are as follows. Albrey Butterfield Jr. is president, Tanya Parnell is vice president, Levine Lamy is secretary, and Wendy Hill the treasurer. The advisory board was also elected with three new members plus the outgoing president and vice president. The three new members on the board are John Hartley, Ron Shaw, and Lester Foreman. All positions are for a two-year term. For WIV4 News, I'm Zoya Fassler.